welcome to Sunderland. Thank you very much. How does it feel to be back in football? Well, nice feeling to be back in football and uh, obviously um, very excited about joining Sunderland. Really, um, it's, um, it's a big moment it's, and uh, I'm hoping that uh, it works out well. Sure it will, but it's, it's of course fair to say that you've got a well-known affinity with the club and, and of course, a, a famous former player. Um, well, I know that uh, it might earn you about two brownie points for, for about a game and a half. I think, but uh, yeah, Sunderland was my favourite team as a, as a boy. Growing up in Northern Ireland, a couple of things, you were either, uh, um, in terms of a religious divide, you were either Celtic or Rangers, but uh, most, of the, uh, most of the boys took an English team on, and mine, uh, um, much to the laughing, I think, of one or two of the other people who would take Manchester United and a few teams like that, I took Sunderland because of Charlie Hurley, and um, I never regretted it, you know. Had a number of fights in the quad with uh, other schoolboys about my choice, but uh, outside that, not a problem. And of course, having managed a few other sides at the Stadium of Light, you'll be familiar with the atmosphere and what the club means to the supporters up here. Yeah, I mean, th when, the, when the Stadium of Light is rocking, it really is uh, it's intimidating and uh, for other teams coming up. And uh, yes, you're right, I have managed uh, on a number of occasions uh, teams that have come up here and um, I think the, the, the move from uh, I think the move from Roker Park to the Stadium of Light was um, was uh, done well. It's, it settled in, and obviously the um, the, um, the lights shining at night time made the made the place a, a bit special. So, uh, and I've just in recent times I've been up there with Aston Villa. So, it's uh, it's still uh, it's still an intimidating place, and um, and a great place if you can win the games. What can the, the supporters of Sunderland Football Club hope to see from, from your side? Well, I, I, naturally, I, I, I mean, obviously, I want to do well. I want to do well uh, for uh, selfish reasons, of course. I want to do well for, uh, for fans. I want to do well for the team. So we can combine this all and, and, uh, and uh, start winning football matches. It would be, it would be terrific. I'm, obviously, all I can say is without promising... Um, you know, the earth, moon and the stars, is that uh, I will do my utmost to, uh, to um, bring a bit of success. And that's, that's what I want to do. You'll, of course, be in charge for the Blackburn game. And then it's into that busy Christmas period that's spoken about an awful lot in football. It is, yeah. And um, because there are a, a number of games in relatively quick succession, then, of course, it, 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 you can, the picture can change so dramatically. You win a couple of games and you find yourself, you know, uh, with great confidence. Lose a couple of matches and it's e exactly the opposite feeling. So yeah, Christmas is is very very important, very important indeed. Always has been, and I think that will continue to be so. The games themselves around this time uh, uh, are are difficult, but you know nothing's insurmountable. And of course, getting straight underway with games will be, I'm, I'm sure, a huge plus. Of course. Um, I mean, every single game's important. Now, the Premiership has become like the holy grail of football. And, um, and you, want to, you want to find yourself established. You want to do... Uh, I mean, it's a uh, great season last year, finishing 10th and a and, um, wee bit of a disappointing start this, this season. But um, things that you're, you know, that you're hoping that um, with, um, well, with a little bit of luck that, uh, that you can turn around. And finally, from me, in the long term, what are you hoping to achieve with Sunderland Football Club? I would like it to be a really successful period, and uh, I'm going to try my utmost to, to achieve that. That's, uh, that's what I've come for, that's what I'm hoping to do. Um, I'd love to give you a full, of, full set of promises here, and uh, well, I, I'll give my utmost, or I, I will do my utmost uh, to bring some success to the football club. That's, that's my, that is my driving ambition.